I mean, I think that's a really interesting one because uh, that means different things to different people. Uh, but I suppose to me personally, a free-minded person is someone who's let go of other people's perceptions, all of the things that hold them back personally. So whether that's how society, friends, family judge them and their choices, it's when they can let that go and make their own decisions in life and do what makes them. Oh, in my life, I was going to say Mahatma Gandhi, but that's not in my life, and also only. But um, in my life, I'd say my sister. My sister, Mukami Korea, she's a free thinker, a, an artist, a creative, a lawyer, an activist, and I think to me that is someone who is a free man. Yes, yeah, this is my this is my first time at a at a free mind. But uh, yeah, it's been amazing. It's been really fun. It's been a great exchange of ideas. Some amazing panelists. Um, I mean, I didn't say anything because I didn't have anything too clever, you know, planned for today. But I think with you know the second and third attempt, I might uh, have something clever enough to say. You know, I I think it was an amazing uh, amazing conversation, amazingly valuable conversation. I. Kenya is coming through like a very crucial time right now with the election in about a week and I think it's good for us to get ourselves out of our bubbles and you know share and have dialogue and and just know well that the way you think doesn't have to be the only way and I think yeah hugely valuable. I think I think some of the views are really interesting and from different perspectives than I have especially a lot of the, you know, the female perspective is something really insightful for me. And you know, that way of looking at, uh, for example, what happened in 2007 through the gendered lens. I think that was, yeah, that was cool, very talented.